we go. Yeah. I'll tell you like this, because I know you didn't know. Woo. I can rap too, just the three. If there's one thing, it's for telling me. Woo. We're doing our show, and now you know. And if there's one thing, it's the green light to go. Hey. Now we're going to ask a question that we should mention. If there's one thing, it goes down here. We got no fear. Now let's get into it. Now we're done, but it's been a lot of fun. Fatal and Liz, they are number one. After the show, is the after party then. What up, world? You already know what time it is, man. It's After Party Radio Show every Sunday, fun day. And we got a promotion, man. We on every Friday at 3 o'clock as well as Sunday. And you know what time it is, man. It's your man, Fatal, the host with the most, with my lovely co-host, Liz, in the building. Lovely Liz in the building. Hey, y'all. What's, What's going good? on? What's up? Who we got with us today, Liz? We have Who's here? Hector Noel G. Why, why you got to start off with Hector? Why can't this be Hector, Noel G. Hector? Noel this, this, G. Why got to be back? I think we got to reintroduce you, bro. <laughs> We should, Noel you, you, G you, in the building. You like that introduction? I, I'm starting to think it's my real name. Yeah, that's, that's what I'm saying. I'm about that's to put saying. that on my license and uh, everything. We're, we're, I'm about to go to the DMV and do a switch. We're going to do the remix right now, man. We got Noel G, a.k.a. Hector in the building Very right now. Awesome. It is an after party show if you did not know. And you've you been killing it, man. I'm hearing about this new Fast and the Furious movie. This is dig straight into it, bro. I like to get straight greedy. No, Let's get straight imagine. to the point, bro. Right. I don't like to wait. Don't, yeah, don't, I'm, even, I'm, don't even put your I'm, feet in the water and am, see if it's am, cold or warm. I am, in, yeah, I I'm, I'm going full, 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 full you, submerged, bro. Let's roll. We're in the abyss right I now, bro. I keep up. I keep up. Okay, that's what I'm she match said. Energy, homie. Hello, I'm match hello, energy. hello. We're going to we, go we keep it cracking. So, what's up with this new Fast and Furious movie coming out? I've seen all this promotion, man. But I'm hearing from you that you're not a part of this film. And how is that even possible at this point, man? Yeah, I was only a one in seven. I was even surprised to come back to part seven, yeah. you know. But it kind of switched up, you know. It kind of became a little too Jackie Chan meets Rambo meets Jet Li. And it kind of <laughs> went a little out there, you know what I'm saying? So for me, to be honest with you, um, I'm kind of like, I'm a fan of Fast and the Furious. I'm more of a fan of the check. But I'm I'm, a, I'm, I'm like we'll get check out I'm like a fan of the original stuff. You know what I'm the saying? The first one. Yeah, I'm not really into, and I don't say that because I'll be straight up. There's some movies I've been in where I'll tell you straight up, straight out that the movie sucked, but the check didn't suck. Yeah, yeah. But so I'm, I say that to what say what movie like, was that? No, no. I'm, damn, I go down the <laughs> list, homie. But I'm just saying the movie Fast and the Furious Part One was actually a legit good movie. Yeah. But you know when it veered off and it got a little crazy and a little out there, I just stopped kind of watching after. It that. did become like a like a big blockbuster. Like it became like every bit. No, Rock is involved now. We got Dwayne Johnson now. We got Jason. They got you know Ha and Shaw. Yeah, and now, whatever. Yeah, yeah and, now uh, he's I, back. I don't even know the joint, but it's yeah. just like every now now Vin Diesel's brothers and the bad guy now all of a sudden like got out wait there, a minute bro. wait a minute. What Vin Diesel yeah. became part of the CIA <laughs> like, and they're what? jumping out of airplanes with Toretto. parachutes and all. I'm like, come on. Dog, right, it's just too what, much. Man. I really liked your part in Training Day. I think I think oh, Fast and the Furious nice. Part Ten. Not to cut you off, Liz. No, I'm it's sorry. It's gonna be like Fast and Furious Underwater. <laughs> you know, and then Fast and Furious Eleven is gonna be like, like Fast and Furious like, like, like what, what else could not happen already? It's right. gotta be. It's gotta be like like yeah, definitely. <laughs> Yeah, underground, yeah. under maybe they could be like mining underground and dig up the, the Earth's core or something. Or you, you know what I mean? You feel? I wouldn't be surprised. He's like I flying cars off a of big building. They're gonna become now. like Fast and Furious meets the George Jetsons. You know what I mean? It's it's out there. It's out there. So she's right though. Training Day is one of my favorite movies from you, man. Yeah, yeah. Definitely. and not to cut you off, it was like yeah. no, I love Training Day. I gotta I gotta give it up to Training Day. I and mean, Netflix that was the movie brought it back a little bit as far as to the yeah. new, to the new, yeah. new listeners, was, new viewers. That, I mean, Training Day is definitely one you have in the bucket. You know what I'm saying? With your Scarface and your Goodfellas and your casino movies. Or whatever yeah. in the gangster mix whatever but yeah it was a blessing to be a part of training day man i was excited that's kind of what kicked off the roller coaster and kind of started the journey like the real journey mm -hmm. so um i can't be mad at training day man training day i, I love and it was actually it was out it was awesome to be a part of that film because that was actually the first movie ever that denzel washington won an academy award for it's the one where he so played a bad a guy is when he went bad so it was the first movie also ever that he played a bad guy in corrupt yeah he, he was so, corrupt. and, and I, personally though i'm keeping it real i think denzel should have won an oscar way before that yeah i think he should have got an oscar for hurricane and I some agree. other movies oh, but man. But to be in the movie that he did get it for and to be a part of that history, I'll take all that. Denzel's movie, Out of Time. You know all those movies are hard, man. Yeah, John yeah. Q, John Q, Johnny Q made me cry. That one about John Q, John Q with a son made me want to cry. Fun fact. Let me give you a fun fact. <laughs> oh my god. Let me give you a fun fact. Oh, dude, Fatel shed a tear, man. That's oh my god. You do got an emotional side. I love Dude. it. I love it, bro. That's what's up. Um, let me give you a fun fact. A so when Training Day popped off, the reason why he did John Q is because he wanted to show transition of character, how he was so bad in Training Day and then how he could play a humble like family man in John Q. So that was the reason from this dramatic to that dramatic, you know? So I thought that was pretty cool. Word, man. Just wanted to throw that little fun right. fact out there. Well, you know? we got to pay some commercial bills real quick. 
We got DJ Cheetos in the mix. Cheetos, you know, like you eat hot Cheetos, right? All day long. Come on. Okay, well, this is your favorite DJ right now. All day long. We're going to have the party show. If you did not know, we'll be right back. No LG in the building. And we're going to get a little crazy with this next game of seat or Noel no. Noel or Hector in the building. No, I'm just I'm going to call you Noel, Noel because LG. I'm playing. I'm playing. I think you got to go to DMV and change your damn I'm gonna put myself ID on right, right now. I'm playing. I'm playing. We'll be right back, man. Game of C or no. No LG in the building. AKA Hector, if you did not know, boy. Let's go. Let's have the party show. After the show, it's the after party. Yeah. Woo! 